First of all, I want to admit to the fact that for some time I have been a little stingy. Or better still, I have been selfish when it comes to sharing information about one project that is yet to be released from the camp of Shata movement. Yes, I admit, I don't want to even debate it or argue it because while so many things are happening behind the scenes, maybe some reflects I'm yet to even give you half of the details that are happening behind the scenes for the Safa album. Uh, just to make it short, the Safa album, also called the Shatter and Fans album, is the next project, the next body of work to come from Shatter Movement Empire. As I talk to you, at least for the past days or weeks that you guys have not heard anything from me about Safa, it was all in preparation. Everything was being done, cooked well, so that you guys, anytime you start enjoying it, you would really enjoy it to the top. Indeed, Safa is ready. As I talk to you, I can hit my test, shout, and say that Safa is ready for those who care. And for those who are waiting for it, Safa is ready. Now, the good thing is that the Safa album is actually going to be something that will re reinvigorate your power. And I'm saying that because most of these songs are songs that you have heard for the past week. Thanks to Shatawale who has been sharing snippets of whatever these songs are about to you guys. So I know you've heard most of these pieces. Now, he has been sharing all these songs with you because the songs are for you. So why should he hold them? Why should he keep them? He knows the songs are for the people. So if the songs are for the people, any time that feel comes, I don't have to hide it. Let me go and share a piece with them. So they can enjoy it and wait for the food. And that's the stands now. As much as most of them are unreleased completely in your ears, in your mind, in your heart, in your houses, in your speakers, I know these songs are already hit songs for you. I know these songs are already big songs for you. Because almost every day, either someone is dancing to them, either someone is banging them at a joint, or someone is also performing them like we have been seeing happening on social media, TikTok, and, and other platforms. You guys are loving them, and so far, so very good. Now, as an insider, somewhere this week, there was the need for me to even personally soak all the songs on the album. That's the Tapa project. Once again, I had the honor, the privilege to listen to all the songs on the album. And I can, that's why I'm not hitting my chest to tell you that the album is ready. No doubt about that. The piece is ready to fly. But then, because we are doing it for you, at every point in time, we also ask, how ready are the people for this? If what we are seeing on social media, the fact that pieces of these songs are always used by people who love the Shaka movement music, they've been using it to do their videos, they've been using it to do their challenge, they've been using it to do their things online alone. It's a testament that many can't wait for this. But there is good news. The good news is that Ashata had said earlier that this is going to be between him and the fans. It remains. Nothing has changed about it. Nothing is different about it. It is still the Shata album for fans. Or Shata and fans album. It is still the same thing. It has not changed. So remember that if you believe in the Shata movement dream, then it's me. You also have a quota in there. If you are a supporter of the Shatter Movement Dream, it means your contribution is in there. If you have been contributing to the Shatter Movement Dream, it means that you are a shareholder. Or do you want me to say stakeholder? Well, I think shareholder rather makes sense because of business. It means you are a shareholder of this project. And for the number of people 
who have also listened to the songs on the album with me. Everybody is talking about the shutter movement that many missed because of how Afrobeat took over the space. And of course, everybody, as much as music is concerned, was trying to change the international market with Afrobeat. Of course, Shatter has a full album, which is the correct album, a complete Afrobeat project. It is for the Afrobeat fans all over the world. With some great songs on it already, they have penetrated to places that they will penetrate at. At parties, during the clubs, so many songs from the Connect album have been played. But then, in Ghana, or better still, how the Shut Up Movement Empire started, there was a sound, there was an energy, there was a spirit behind what he called Shut Up Music. Shut Up Music maybe might have gone on a break of a sort. Or, like some people say, it went on a hiatus. Now, after some years of resting the Shatter Movement energy, it is now time for Shatter Wale himself to lead the pack, to activate, to re-energize, to bring back to life the Shatter Movement music once again. And this is what the Safa is all about. Now, the pieces that you guys have been listening online, like Jenny God and the rest of these songs I know and all these songs that you guys have been loving online, the energy is not dead yet. The energy is even revitalized. And personally, after listening to them, I said, wow, this is what we have all been missing one way or the other, but we never even realized it. This is what we were all looking forward to enjoy. But we were not even paying attention to the fact that we were missing it. But now, it is coming. Now, because I always love the business side of the music, one of the things that I enjoyed after listening to all the selections, all the collections on the project was the fact that these songs have stage presence, or stage power, as you may want to call it. You know, as an artist, it is not every song that will qualify for the stage. As an artist, it is not every song that when it comes to preparing a playlist for a performance, it is not every song that will qualify. An artist knows this. Every artist knows this. That is why some songs may be your favorite from some artists. When they are performing during concerts, if you are not careful, you will never hear such songs performed as well. Because... Those songs come with a different style, different energy, different attitude and all. And if you are looking for that energetic delivery, it is hard for you to consider them. But then, I can assure you, just as Shatawala himself loves it. On the stage, he loves it hot, 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 like you say, she say, she. On the stage, he wants it hard, 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 she say, she. On the stage, he wants to exert energy so that when... During his performance, he intermittently does his preaching. The songs that you follow will come and complement the messages. Because that is what he's been doing. In the middle of his performance, he will take a break and preach to the people. Preach the word of God to the people. Let the people understand that this is the word of God. Listen to it and have life. Sometimes he even goes ahead to pray for them. So many times on stage, Shatta has prayed for his fans. Many of these fans have received their blessings. Some have traveled out of Ghana. Some are now into profitable businesses. Some are also inspired. No matter how they deep they were in the trenches, now they are all up and awake doing their own thing. That is an attitude of someone who inspires. And I can tell you, personally, like I'm telling you, because I enjoy the business side of this thing. When I listened to the songs on the project, I said, yeah, the stage is about to be lit. The stage is about to get active. I remember when we went to Bolga for the Bolga um, Jaga 4 BTS concert at the Bolga Sports Stadium. That kind of response, the energy, the impact. I saw from fans when I know what played. It was crazy. A new song that has not been heard. Sometimes you ask yourself, how, how did they do it? 
You ask yourself, how were they able to come in with that unison, in that energy to sing it? It is because it does it for them. So if it is that energy you are looking for, be it on a stage, off stage, in the clubs, at the parties, in your rooms, on your phones, in your ears, then I can also tell you to drop everything and keep your anticipation very high. Because it is going to be a great album. It is going to be something that you would love. It is going to be something that everybody would want to say that, yeah, indeed, the Shatter spirit, the Shatter music spirit is re-energized. I remember when Shatter, I think he released um, the Sniper of Uncle or one of the songs on Twitter. Agenda Boys made it their favorite. Everybody was sharing it. At every point in time, there were people who said, yes, this is what we've been missing. Blogs were posting it like, Shatter is packing so many hits. Now the hits are ready. Some features here among some of our artists. One that you know, a young guy that is really making waves. One that you are loving, straight from rap to singing. And he has also been connected on one of the songs, ready to blow it hard. And personally, it came out as one of my favorites. The style attitude delivery on that particular song was crazy. I am, I am not too sure of my favorite yet. I am not too sure of my favorite yet because out of the day, the listening happened for me. I came across so many of these songs that I loved. So many of them. Some of them, the released one, and some of them unreleased. So many of them that I loved. So at the moment, if you ask me, okay, Samus Flex, what is your favorite? I know it's going to be very difficult for me to choose my favorite now, but very well, I will still have so many favorites in there. I'm just waiting for the right time, date of release, how fans are going to be involved, the activations around it, the parties around the concerts around it, the flutes around it, the invasions around it. Then, when all these things are right and set up, then it means that we are ready. So, for Shutter Movement fans, I'm not wetting your appetite. Yeah. I know I've hidden so many things from you guys. The reason I started by admitting the fact that, admitting to the fact that I've been very stingy with information on Safa, I have not been telling you guys more. But now I think the road is clear. Uh, like medical said, road clear anyhow, no police. Now the road is clear. So I just have to come out and prep you that start warming up. Those who are just going to be selected, start warming up, put on your jerseys and your boots. Get ready to strike. Because this strike should bring gold. This strike should bring all the wins that you can think about. It's all about the Safa, that's the Shatter and Fans album. And as an independent artist, I keep saying that one of your strongest weapons that you can use at any point in time is your fan base. And Shatter being an independent artist, I know his fans have never disappointed him. Be it ticket sales to shows, be it coming out to show love on social media, at every point in time, they are up there and out there showing love and support. And Safa Project, the energy we need is exactly what we have been receiving over the years. Personally, I can't wait. And I know you can't wait either. Date of release and everything will be presented to you guys at the right time. At the moment. Team is working behind the scenes to make sure the roadmap is clear. And when the roadmap is clear, the way you want it is exactly how we give it to you. So today, I came to just revive your spirits on the Safa project. But I know I've not spoken about it in a long while. And not doing that means I'm keeping some information away from you. Uh, yes, the team has been busy doing this and that, making sure everything comes out the way we want it. And now that I can tell you everything is complete, ready to go, I just have to also let you know. So you start warming up. You start waiting for it because the anticipation for this, personally, I can't wait. And I know you also can't wait. So tell someone that Safa is still dressing. Yeah, like that, prophet. Anytime.